and of course the first place people tend to react mm -hmm. because it comes so easy is on social media yeah. and you saw a very swift reaction from not only people who were actually there we were getting a lot of information but then afterward from people reacting to the scene celebrities especially Many celebrities Ricky Martin came out uh, initially saying I'm gay and I'm not afraid love conquers all Hashtag pray for Orlando. And we also have um, Ellen DeGeneres, I believe, who uh, was tweeting as well um, her feelings about it. And Justin Timberlake, who said, pray for Orlando. He, he also said, what gives? My heart is breaking right now for the victims and families of this act, heartless act. We heard from Ellen DeGeneres, who kept it simple. She just said, sobbing. And the, uh, we're also getting reaction from around the world. The official Paris Twitter account wrote, Paris stands with Orlando. We're thinking of you. Hashtag love wins. And there was a newspaper from overseas that called this America's Bataclan, which is in reference mm -hmm. to the club there in Paris. And this one we're looking at now is from uh, the nonprofit organization Rebel and Riot. It shows a heartbeat pattern, but in the end, you see the rainbow there trailing off. Now it's again in tribute to the victims, and they say that, that this was a hate crime at Pulse and that they stand with the victims. It is the first a president saying it is not only a terrorist crime, but is a hate crime indeed. But all around the world, like the city hall in Tel Aviv, lit up in the pride colors. Mm -hmm. And the Freedom Tower in New York as well. The Empire State Building, dark last night, also in tribute. We'll leave you with this image.